American oral and written traditions by Selena C., Chantel M., and Riley J. People have always told stories, even in Africa. In this video, you will see the written and oral traditions of Western Africa. These are griots. Griots are the artists and poets of the tribes. Griots are also teachers. Since the griots learn so much, they teach the tribe and others of what they know. In some ways, they could also be called recorders. Western Africa's oral tales also include hundreds of old stories that we call folk, folk tales. tales. That's right, we call them folk tales. Folk tales are so old that they go back all the way to the 1500s. That's a really long time. There's another type of folk tale that's called the trickster tales. Trickster tales are folk tales that have a moral, clever animal, or human that is tricking the other. One famous trickster tale is the tortoise and the hare. West Africans brought their tales here to America, and now we know a whole lot of folk tales. Folk tales that are written on paper are now called written traditions. Proverbs and sayings. Proverbs and sayings are what we use today, and it's found in all cultures. In Africa, there is a proverb that shows how much they value their stories. A good story is like a garden carried in the pocket. That's a pretty good proverb, and it shows us something about the Africans and their stories. The, the end. end.